I've actually been a part of the U.S. para team somewhat since 2014 when I was in high school. That's when I was identified as a para rower. Um, and I went to the selection camp in 2014. Didn't make it, but um, I was still familiar with the, the head of the U.S. para rowing and some of the rowers. And so when I came back, it was just basically seeing old friends uh, again and some new faces as well. But how it works with rowing is uh, during the world championships the year before the, the Olympics are scheduled to take place, um, you have to get a certain placement to automatically qualify for the Tokyo Olympics. Um, so for us, that was the 2019 world championships in Linz, Austria. Uh, and we raced that, we automatically qualified. We got second to Great Britain. Um, however, it, it was a bit of a hectic summer because I originally wasn't scheduled to be in the boat uh, that summer. I was working in, in New York City, uh, working in my summer job, still training for Columbia Rowing. Um, and then they had some difficulty where one of the guys dropped out of the boat. And so I was called up to fill in um, and we still qualified the boat. Yeah, I, I think we all figured out. So unfortunately, um, we weren't all together uh, for the past for that year. Uh, for example, I was in I was in Ireland uh, getting my master's at Trinity. Uh, another one of my boatmates, he was up in Vermont at a rowing center there. And then the two other people in the boat, they were also rowing on their own. Um, and we all stayed in touch and we all we're given training plans by our coach and connecting remotely um, and all trying to get as much face-to-face -face as we can. Uh, just reminding ourselves that there is, there is a goal at the end of this that we want to uh, achieve. And you know, through all the solo training sessions that it will be, it will be worth it. I think personally, I'm most excited for the opening ceremonies and at least being around the rest of Team USA. I think that for me is going to be the most special because it'll really feel like one team. And again, also seeing other teams as well, other countries and sort of that culture of the Olympics and Paralympics. And I think the global scale of the competition and the level that you have to you know, set yourself up for.